Christopher Robin and I walked along under branches lit up by the moon Posing our questions to Al and Eeyore as the days disappeared all too soon But I've wandered much further today than I should And I can't seem to find my way back to the wood you know what happens next, right? It's the chorus. House at Pooh Corner is one of my favorite Kenny Loggins tunes. This was a request by a viewer, and so here I am teaching it to you. If you have a request for a song or a technique you'd like me to teach, you can put it in the comments below, and uh, maybe I'll get to it. I will show you the picking pattern, the chords, and then I'll play the first part of the song so that you can play it with me. All right, so here are the chords. D. E minor. F sharp minor. B minor. You can either do a bar chord. Or you can do this version. There's also a G, A, C, and then at the very end there's a B. There's only one B, so you don't necessarily have to do that one. It just sounds really cool at the very end. If you want all the words and the chords, you'll find them in a link underneath this video. Now, before I get too far into the picking pattern and the rest of the song, you've probably figured out that this is not a song for beginners. It's really best for intermediate players. However, let me qualify that. If you've been playing for a little while and you're still kind of a beginner but you're ready to push up to the next level, this might be a good song to do that because it has a bar chord, it's got a walk down, and some really cool things that are really great to learn. And like anything with guitar, if you take your time and practice a lot, then you will eventually get there and learn how to do it. Um, this might be a song that you don't learn in one sitting, and that's cool, you know. Take your time with it, turn the video off once in a while, practice that picking pattern a little bit, or those challenging chords a little bit. Just take it in chunks. Here's the picking pattern I'll demonstrate on a D. So it's bass, three, two, one. I'm calling out the string numbers. So bass, which is the fourth string on a D. Third string from the bottom with my index finger. The next string with my middle finger and then the bottom string with my ring finger. So play that with me. Ready and bass, three, two, one. Bass, three, two, one. See if you can speed it up a little. And you probably noticed that I am playing this with the capo on the second fret and that's so that I can sing it. So as you're learning the song, Put the capo on the second fret like I do, and then after you learn the song, you can put the capo anywhere you want, or you can just take it off, and uh, that might better accommodate your voice. Before we go further, please buy me a coffee. It's only $3, and it's a great way to support my channel. Another great way to support it is to support me via Patreon, and for as little as $5 a month, you can get cool perks like exclusive Zoom lessons from me. I mean, these are lessons where you can interact with me. These aren't just lessons on YouTube. Now the chorus has a very cool walk down from D to A. Here's the walk down in the chorus. You play a D, and then you're going to reach your little finger up to the fourth fret on the fifth string, and it's a D over C sharp. Okay? Then you're going to pick up these two fingers, and this finger is going to go on the second fret, fifth string and then it goes to the A. Okay? Here's a close-up of that walk down. D, D over C sharp, D over B, A. I'll do that again. Okay, time
time to sit down. <laughs> oh, so fancy at these videos. Um, okay, so let's play this song together. Here we go. Ready and Christopher Robin and I walked along under branches lit up by the moon. Posing our questions to Al and Eeyore as our days disappeared all too soon. But I wandered much further today than I should. And I can't seem to find my way back to the wood So help me if you can I've got to get back to the house at Pooh Corner by one You'd be surprised there's so much to be done Count all the bees in the hive Chase all the clouds from the sky Back to the days of Christopher Robin and Pooh. And then it goes on to uh, the rest of the song. If you want the words and the chords to the whole song, you'll find them in a link underneath this video. So there you go, House at Pooh Corner. What a lovely song. Please check out the rest of my lessons. I have over 500 for beginning and intermediate guitar, mandolin, and ukulele players. I have lots of special playlists. I have a playlist especially for intermediate players, which is where this video is going to go. I also have one for beginning players if you want something that's simpler. Um, there's a playlist there for blues. I mean, how cool is that, right? Um, please check out my original music, jamieanderson.com. Thanks a lot, everybody.